Hi everyone, Wally Nichols with the Asset Guidance Group weekly update for the week ending March the 25th, 2022. Uh, it's been an interesting week. Uh, there's a lot of talk uh, with the volatility that's gone on uh, as, as to whether to buy this dip or sell this rally. Uh, we do see some indecision uh, over the last uh, several days of this week in, in conjunction with last week's move up and then this week's move up and then pull back slightly. We see indecision running across the averages. Uh, the NASDAQ can't quite get out of correction territory. The S&P pulled its way through and made it. The uh, small and mid cap are still uh, in correction territory. The overall market, the Russell 3000, uh, is in correction territory. So the question is, is this rally for real in light of the Russia-Ukraine conflict and its impact on commodities, which is going to steepen the inflation rate uh, problem? And then we had uh, very hawkish statements uh, uh, from Chair Powell that's coming in uh, earlier this week saying, look out for a 50 basis point uh, uh, interest rate hike in as early as May. So that's just two uh, months away. And so uh, that would be, you know, uh, perhaps more aggressive action by the Fed. That would be uh, generally taken as a downside for equities. And yet equities rallied up against that. Uh, and the question is, you know, how do, how do we move forward in this? Well, everything has to be taken in accordance with an individual uh, investor's uh, risk tolerance and, and propensity for uh, um, balancing returns given appropriate exposure to be sure. But generally speaking, there are a number of, of very conservative plays that we can employ on your behalf and still give you the full ride uh, as we move through these choppy waters. There are very conservative plays, uh, among which uh, some of them are known as the most conservative play uh, in, in trading. And so uh, we implement those in appropriate circumstances uh, as our focus has shifted to total return this year as we get through this reopening coming out of post-pandemic as COVID becomes endemic to the society and then as, as, as this unbelievable uh, potential world conflicts uh, uh, try to work themselves hopefully to a positive re resolution soon. Uh, that is roiling the markets uh, worldwide but that we can employ to keep the, the pattern smoothed out a little bit uh, for everyone. So we're looking at, at uh, double digit return potentials in certain uh, fixed income alternatives, which are pegged to equities, um, but are, are not really uh, equities. Uh, and, 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 and we're having to employ those over, over certain time periods. So uh, then there are other plays that we have that are uh, pure equity plays. So it's just a matter of how you wanna allocate your portfolios but there are ways to manage our way throughout this very uh, extreme volatilities that we're seeing, very choppy waters, so to speak, and, and, and still provide you with the, the, the type of return that's required to get you where you need to be. Of course, you know that uh, uh, if uh, you've uh, allowed us to do your planning, we've got your core investments safe so that you can take more risk with your uh, at-risk money in the markets, and so that helps you sleep better at night, and that's where we would like everyone to get to. Give us a call, 404-348-4120, uh, or shoot us an email. I'm W. Nichols at AssetGuidanceGroup.com. You can reach Jared at JW Nichols at AssetGuidanceGroup.com. Get on our calendar, come on in, let's uh, work your numbers and put together a plan that's appropriate for you, and rebalance your portfolios here as we get uh, closing out Q1 2022 moving into Q2 and let us show you how this total return concept, concept is going to work out to your best interest. All right. In the meantime, stay happy until we see you again.